peak cyclist form is being uh, bean shaped. I honestly think you could not stop a cyclist if they were shaped like a 1996 Ford Taurus. The wind would look at how ugly the car is and would simply choose not to make contact with you. Hang on, I got a burp. Hello, Simvicta. I always like to start off the stream. It took us 18 minutes, but we got to one good joke. Okay, let's get dulls going today. I love the dulls, man. Dude, that is peak arrow. What is that one again? Thank egg. Thank egg. Let me get a Luxembourg. It's closer to Cyprus, okay? Noted. Let me get a Uganda. It's adjacent. Holy cow. Let me get a Kenya. Oh! My geography is getting a little better. A little better. And then, of course, a world I realize there's probably only like 10 countries in the world. I'm just got to, I, I got to level with you. I'm not. This does, I mean, it doesn't look like an island to me, which is not fair because all I'm seeing is a silhouette. It, I don't think it's Suriname. That's too close to French Guiana. I, we got to start guessing some islands, dude. This is um, Antigua and Barbu. That's probably two islands now that I think about it. Um, Maybe this is what Barbados looks like. Oh! <laughs> oh! For me to get something in the Caribbean is actually like less likely than getting something in Africa for me. Every day we get a little bit better at geography. Bit by terrible bit. And now, I mean, I wish you the best of luck on this one. This one looks very tough. <clears throat> box office game it is like Memorial Day weekend 1993 at the sperm bank she asked for a tall intelligent black man one out of three ain't bad <laughs> give me the plot I have no idea what this is A young black woman discovers her father was a sperm donor, and as if that wasn't bad enough, he's white. <laughs> I don't know what this is. <laughs> I give up. Made in America. All right. I've never seen that one. Ooh. The 90s, man. Take me back, or don't. I don't know. Insert your own biases. 19... I'm tapping. I feel like I was almost there, but I don't know it. What's the, what's the solution? Nightcrawl, Jake Gyllenhaal, Riz Ahmed? It's Nightcrawler. Sound of Metal is the movie I was trying to think of. That one, that one hurts a little bit. I am not insulting the puzzle, but as far as I'm concerned, Marvel, Spider, it looks like Heavy Rain too. It, heavy Rain as well. It just depends on how detailed the bathroom is and how dirty it is. It's not Silent Hill 3. I could easily see this being heavy rain. Metacritic score not applicable? That's not fair. Heavy rain probably has like a 98 on Metacritic. People were probably bending over backwards to blow each other. Oh, we take a video game so seriously. Blah, 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 blah. Doesn't even matter. Yeah, the plot doesn't make sense, but it has a plot. Maybe it's Indigo Prophecy. Just has, oh no, it's definitely not Indigo. It's Escape from Tarkov! Another game with dirty bathrooms, okay. It's 
Half Life Alex Vance, but it's not on the list. This is Rainbow Six S- Siege. This is Counter Strike Global Offensive. This is Counter Strike. This is Counter Strike Source. (laughs) (coughs) Pardon me. That's tough. It had, I could tell from the textures that it was, uh, that it was Valve. Just something about the vest. That's Valve, man. Valve gives people cargo vests. Guess the game artwork. Okay, I'm telling you. Sometimes you just see an ad and you're like, nah. I'm not, I'm not putting that ad on the screen. This to me looks like This looks like Dust Force. It's not even in the list. It looks like Celeste. I'm insane. I'm unbelievable. And now the hardest... I mean, this might be the hardest of all the dulls, quite frankly. You always start Dark Souls 2. Oh, fuck. (laughs) This is actually... It's Power Rangers. I honestly... Let me at least get to the hint before we call it. It's New Super Mario Brothers 2. It's New Super Mario Brothers U. Oh, good. It's made by Bandai Namco. Can I just, it's um, Super Mario, Marvel vs. Capcom, Clash of Superheroes. It's um, Plumber Time. It's uh, Elevator Action. It's um, Turok the Dinosaur Hunter. It's um, A Short Hike. It's um, Age of Empires. It's uh, be, to be in Finland in 1991. Downtown Helsinki, 1991. This is the place to be, man. This guy's on his way to invent C++, change the world as we know it. This may or may not be Cobalt Streak. I'm not 100% sure. Look at, dude, what is this? The the tight shirt, I don't even, is that like four pairs of sunglasses in the collar? Or are these... Are these buttons or or straps? I don't know, but he's he's serving for sure. Holy. I don't think this is 1991. I mean, look at the automobile. I mean, they're not sending up, like, the world's best cameras in the space shuttle because, like, every gram costs them a million dollars to shoot into space. So they probably just had, like, the same Nikon cool picks up on the International Space Station since, like, 2006 or something. Give me a 2014 on this one. Ooh. I don't know if I was right for the wrong reasons or right for the right reasons, but still. Everybody's well-dressed. The photo is black and white. This is Central Park. Ah, Central Park. In Newark. Pretty bad. Mostly just because of that last guess, though. Okay, Housel. <clears throat> Presented by Ashley Crane. Houses to get murdered by a tech CEO inside. POV. The serial killer has moved you to a second location.
This shit looks like it's straight out of like Quantum of Solace or something like that. I, <laughs> I mean, this looks, you, you have to be rich to buy this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start a little high. I don't know where it is. I'm going to assume it's California. I'm going $21 million. I know that's way up there. That's too high. Okay. It's duly noted. It's in Michigan. No one is in Michigan. I probably would have adjusted my guess down at least a little bit. But it's on the water in Bloomfield Township, Michigan. I was still, I, I can't see myself going below four on this. Okay, well, I'm going to be going below four. Most aesthetic house in, in Michigan history. POV, you turned um, your, the, what's left in your cast iron skillet after making a grilled cheese into two pieces of one-of-a-kind artwork. 5,000 square feet. Give me $600 a square foot and adjust it down. Give me $2.75 million. It's too low. Okay, we, we're, we're, we're cutting it. We're, we're in the middle. I'm going to say it's near Piccadilly Circus, near the Forbidden Planet London Megastore. And... Um, I'm in danger. This is not England. <laughs> this is this is Finland. There's three eyes in a seven letter word. The only country on earth that can get away with that is is Finland. Maybe Finland nineteen sixties. Ah, uh, to be in downtown Helsinki in 1957. You were uh, 1970, but holy cow, at least on the geography, we were doing great there. You got 7,000. Okay, that's uh, maybe this is the death of Lenin. Color photo, though. Color photo. Maybe, maybe it has nothing to do with the death of Lenin. This is like a nuclear missile or something. <laughs> we, okay, it was Moscow, 1964. Not too bad. Not too bad. This is the Kaiser and the Burgermeister of Hamburg. This motherfucker is called the Burgermeister of Hamburg. Are you kidding me? Can you imagine having... He didn't even know. He didn't even know how funny his, uh, his title was. The Burgermeister of Hamburg. Anyway, this is like... Kaiser and Burgermeister, Germany. The Kaiser abdicated and fled at the end of the Second World War. So the maximum date this could be... This feels like this is like Belgium or the Netherlands. And they're, they're destroying a street. They hate sidewalks. This is the gang of sidewalk haters. Or are they building the sidewalk and they're just cold? That's why they've obscured their faces is because it's the winter time. Maybe the bricks are coming back into their hands and they're placing them down. I feel like this, wherever it is, I feel like it's late 1970s. Put me in 77 and then put me in the Netherlands. Put me in... Amsterdam. I mean, considering the information that we had there, I think that was pretty good. (laughs) 
is literally 1984. You're, you're not wrong. Final score? 40,000. Dude, I think that's pretty good. That's pretty good. How are you better at this than GeoGuessr? Well, because the photos are, like, noteworthy. In GeoGuessr, they just drop you on, like, a road in Uganda. And they're like, good luck, motherfucker. In this one, it's like a picture of, like, the, the president of the United States giving a speech. And behind him is, like, the governor of California. And you're like, I'm going to guess that this is in Sacramento. People are like, Whoa! Yeah, you got Bill Clinton hanging out with Bono, surrounded by like a bunch of Irish memorabilia. Okay, slash marker me. He's the Burgermeister of Hamburg on the photo. Yes, that was, that was helpful. That was upside down, David Blaine next to the President of the United States. Okay, slash marker, that was the dolls today. I think we did okay. Did all right. I'm just going to get some water. Then I'm going to come back. We're going to play Wild Frost. I did download it. By the way, we have London at noon. Wild Frost, new, new deck building roguelite. I'll be right back. One billion dollars. River Dance did sweep the nation. He's sixty four years old, he's still lighting it up. River Dance really ran for twenty two years. By the way, this is why I was talking about Riverdance. I forgot that the desktop audio was muted this whole time. <laughs> Riverdance is a theatrical show that consists of traditional Irish music and dance. It originated as an interval act during Eurovision 1994. Be able to do whatever you want in your life for the most part. Drunk moms, I, it's one of... It, when you see like a group of young people and they're drunk, you're like, that's the time in your life. When I see a group of, like, people in their 50s that are hammered, I just am like, it's always like, you're too old to woo. I'm sorry. You're too, for, you're too old to woo without being judged. Just because what, Don't Stop Believing came on? You got to let everybody know you like Journey? I know you like Journey. Because your generation still has, like, way too much pull in the culture. I, I can't forget about Journey. It's the 80s for fucking forever. Can you just let it progress a little bit? Boo, tomato, tomato. You're going to get there. You're going to get there. You're going to be trying to enjoy like a nice dinner. And there will be like a 47-year-old woman's bachelor. Freeze your counter. I'm going to snow stick you again to freeze your counter. We get to attack for three, and you've been killed. So one of the reviews I saw of this, I'm, I'm losing my mind, said after 10 attempts and failing to kill the, to defeat the first combat, I decided the balancing was off. Really? Have you tried following the text that they give you in the game and, and making appropriate decisions accordingly? Take me to the journal page. The Wild Frost. If anyone is reading this, that's me. Use the knowledge. Then we gotta ice you. You gotta die. Then straight up, I'm like, take a snow cake. Although maybe we should save that for an inevitable boss. Big Peng! Gain one when an ally is killed. That would seem to me like we should try to rush you down. Um, I would like to redraw, please. Actually, you know what? One card? Yeah, I'd like to redraw, please. 
I was, I was going to say, I need Big Barry out there. You have one life left. Big Barry? I think you're probably going to need to heal five. If you if you whisper codes to moderator Jess Yabeb, they can give them away for sure. And thank you. I'm realizing I'm going to lose though. <laughs> I thought I was so smart, but now it's all going to fall apart. Nobody's at risk of dying right now. We're also not going to get a kill though. Let let me get a redraw. I gotta remember I can bring them back to heal them as well. Certainly feels like Big Barry needs to live. But then you're gonna get hit and die. You do two. You do one. You do four. <laughs> That's really bad. <laughs> I think, hang on here. Start me off with a pink berry juice on Big Berry just so he lives. He died by one. <laughs> um, scrappy sword me. Give me some armor. Oh, that's not armor. Oh, it doesn't even kill you. You have four HP. I what was I thinking. It's actually all going to... Queen Globbery. And then redraw all my cards. Now you, oh uh, dude, you move up and then you take a little nutshell cake and holy cow, you just got the kill, look at that. And you all laughed at the nut synergy. More pets or a bling snail cave? I don't think we need, I'm content with my amount of pets. It's like already too much for me to manage with my limited mental skill set. I think it was a good shop. Be careful, Shelbo also does two damage. Oh, take me out of the shop, please. I've made a mistake. Take me to the woolly snail. <laughs> Take me to the boss. There we go. Infernoco. When an ally is killed, gain their attack. You have zero attack. I think it would be awesome to just take a hit immediately and then basically kill your ass. My three... Acorn to the ally behind. He's, he's fully nutted, dude. Look at him. He's got a nut lantern. He's got a nut hat. And he's got a nut shield. Nut pauldrons. Nut chest piece. He's probably got a nut tunic on under that. Nut leggings. Give me Colonel, please. Aimless. Seven... Seven damage aimless is is mighty spooky. Eat a random ally, absorbing everything. <laughs> what? Oh, enemies move first, but Snuff's timer should have been on zero instead of on one. That zero goes before one. Oh, I use Sunrod instead of the drum. For some reason, I thought I was using the drum. Oh! <laughs> it was literally just the wrong card. It was a good run, though. We're learning. We did not kill 100 enemies. We, that's starting another run. This is our daily. Did we not unlock anything? 
We didn't recall. We have, we've recalled zero companions. That's true. We've not achieved a 3x kill combo and gained 50 blings from a single battle. All right. This is um, Wild Frost, slash marker Wild Frost. It's good, and the reviewers are just bad, honestly. I rarely say that. I, I hate when, uh, like, a movie comes out, and then critics are like, the movie's ass, and then people are like, oh, yeah, so it's not uh, Lydia Tarr's bio, but, like, if you just, if you like fun, then it's a fun movie. But these critics are always trying to make themselves seem so smart. I hate when people say that, but this is actually, like, I think in this situation, the Steam reviewers are just, like, legit wrong. This seems like a great deck builder so far, and I'm enjoying myself uh, immensely. I don't know, I gotta start eating just, like, regular, regular beef. Beef nicey. Sorry, I got three cashews left. I feel like it's always three letters. I, two letters I, is unhinged. I often see two letters, I think. That's wild. I respect it. I'm being told M.A. is just French for best before. <laughs> that's yeah, my, that's my year of all. <laughs> I think that's what it is, actually. What the hell? When does this stuff go bad? I got 72 another... yakults I've been feeding to my two-year-old. Yeah. What, what, what else does it say on it? Uh, 17 2003 is, what, is July it? July 1st maybe <laughs> mine literally says 23 M A O 8 see that's what's driving me crazy i don't know if you should drink that stuff all right good race good race yeah, i'm drowning race. i'm drowning i know <laughs> that swimming fast has to be hard i just can't imagine like getting a good workout while swimming because you're just like you're in the bath <laughs> like i just can't imagine like someone finishing a, a race in swimming and then getting out of the water and being like <gasps> like what was the water too cold or something like dude new new bit where uh ryan is like an inch big and the bathtub is a massive swimming pool <laughs> <laughs> Round of the men's 25 meter Jesus rapid start Christ. is ready to go. Oh, I have to go. at the same time. And you know what? I paid off. It sounds like Shadowrun. <laughs> By the way, sprint away and pee the second I finish <laughs> okay. this line. I heard that the, dunge uh, the Dungeons and Dragons movie is really authentic. Is there an 80 minute scene where the most annoying guy you've ever met tries to fuck everybody in a tavern? Can you chill, man? That's just my campaign. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I needed to get the joke out before the that was good. The, the game started. I liked it. Dude, All right, thank you. My, my character has magical short shots. He can change the length of. That's pretty cool. Oh, fuck off. B? I thought it was in first place. Fuck the button press up. Oh, Daniel, okay. thank you My for the My guy is going red. Thank He's, you for the about raid. to explode. <laughs> Congratulations <laughs> on your performance today, Daniel. Wait, did Dan do something? I, I, I didn't hear him. <laughs> yeah. Dan's got shooters in every chat. I love whenever there's a raid, all like the meme chatters all rush to post at the same time. We got REM posters like, it's my time to shine. Let me put some REM lyrics in chat. We got Scat Eyes saying Northern Lion Harem. We got uh, all the, what the fuck? <laughs> all the all the meme Twitter accounts are like, ah, oh, fresh blood, fresh blood. Oh no, my right stick went in all weird. Honestly, 
lightning to think oh. the levels watch your ankles oh i i fucked up i'm dead my guy died he, i actually just oh my guy's dead i'm disqualified in the middle how, how of the night how come long jumpers or high jumpers get like 25 chances to do the same jump but this one you get three because they would actually die i think yeah i don't think they have enough strength to... even move the bar off the floor I do Who's like this. Uh, one of your meme shadows <laughs> is completely normal in my chat. Is it scant eyes? <laughs> and then, small head bit. Do you know you're in Discord? Yeah, you got a problem? Okay, sorry. I just saw you pop back in after. Bro, get out of here. I'm trying to make my head small. <clears throat> you got it. It's an optical illusion. I'm not actually shrinking the size of my head. What, you've never seen a guy with a small head before? It's a perfectly normal sized head. I've had it measured by the doctor. I'm, it's, I don't have a small head. I just have a really wide shoulder. It's a perfectly cromulent head. Do a helium voice. Why are you making fun of my head? I know what you're thinking. It's a normal sized head. I had it checked. Something like that. And then do the run fast bit. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Uh, it doesn't it, it, for that one you gotta because the angles are different. For that one you gotta be like. Anyway. <clears throat> Kate's still sick. She's not going to stream. 